not only did I get an early flight, but uh, Doc Emmerich was about a row in front of me. He lives in Michigan, so Doc and I uh, were able to share a, a good Delta flight on the way home. So uh, fun, fun run, fun night last night for sure. Yeah, I mean, he is, Mike, I mean uh... – what, I, I want to give you the floor on him just for a second. I, I, obviously, I, I geek out on announcing for, for good reason. <laughs> but I, I just I, his choice of words, it's, it is, it's like he's playing around with, the English, with a dictionary while he's got a microphone he, on. He, he's, he's, he's terrific and uh, always, always had a high appreciation for, for Doc going back to when he you know, was doing the Devils games. Uh, but being around him, uh, that appreciation has grown even more. And doing three hockey games this year, uh, calling games, it's it's uh, such a hard sport to cover, as you said, because of the speed, the pace of the game. You you have no chance to look at a note or notes during the game, and uh, it's just an appreciation for how well he does it and how long he's done it. And his passion and connection to the game is extraordinary. You know, I I think if it was a young broadcaster coming up, uh, they wouldn't they wouldn't say or people wouldn't say, hey, that's a good style to use because of uh, the amount of verbiage compared to other TV broadcasters. Uh, it's all let, let the pictures tell the story. But Doc's command of the language and his use of unique verbs and adjectives to describe make it entertaining that, uh, that you don't hear that complaint about it. He's, uh, he's a wonderful person and extremely talented. And uh, it's been fun for me the last couple of years being at NBC and being around the finals a few times and other hockey events to be around him. He's a great, great man. For more of the Rich Eisen Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV for free on BR Live or download the Rich Eisen Show app.